the debate about class in the United States, and I think this is what's made our challenge quite considerable today, is always conducted obliquely because everybody belongs to the middle class. So we end up with conversations about the 1%, the 99%, the 47%. The 47% number is particularly interesting. It became an enormous uh, problem for Romney when it was leaked that he talked about a kind of 47% of people who would never vote Republican because they were in some form or other of benefit, didn't pay uh, income tax. And he retracted that. But in some ways, I think he was wrong to retract it entirely because the, the fundamental analysis about the way this country is changing so that there are more and more people on one form or another of state benefit and fewer and fewer people paying direct income tax, that is a dangerous trend. I've seen the future because I grew up in a part of Western Europe where this happened at a much earlier stage. Today in my country, Scotland, 90% of households are on some kind of benefit or other. And if the United States doesn't address the ratchet effect, the tendency for dependency to breed dependency, it will end up in that place where the majority of households, and then nearly all households, become dependent on some kind of transfer from the state. You know I'm glad so Romney raised it, and I'm sorry he ran away from the issue.